We dropped 37 in solo quads with the STG. This is by far the best AR in the game. We'll go over the build right after the gameplay, but if you enjoyed the video, you know what to do. Now let's get to the gameplay. Did I get a kill from Oh, right, right, right. I didn't see that man in front of me. Oh, I knocked him with that number. Oh, what are you doing, pal? Do that. Oh, stop running. Oh, wait, so much. Oh, Target down. Marking the rest of them. Fire sales over. Adjusting prices. Emergence has closed. No more second chances. Oh 
Oh my lordy. Enemy soldier incoming. You got gas moving in. The enemy lost track of you. Good work down there. Go, 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 go. Stay sharp. I'm going to be the For the first attachment, I use the Cassis Break Muzzle. This helps out the horizontal recoil control and the firing aim stability. For the barrel, the best option is the C70 Long Barrel. If we look at the stats, we see how much this helps out the damage range and bullet velocity. Next, you want to make sure you're using the DR79 Combo Stock. If we look at the stats, we see this helps out the recoil gun kick by minus 21% and the horizontal vertical recoil control by minus 11%. This is a very important attachment to use. And then for the underbarrel, we're going to use the Bruin Heavy Support Grip. This helps out the gun kick control, aiming out of sway, and horizontal recoil control. And for the final attachment, I use the 50 round drum. And here's the complete build. I also use another build. Sometimes I take off the combo stock because if you look at the stats, this does slow down the ADS speed by plus 5%. So sometimes I take this off and I put on the Citadel rear grip. If we look at the stats for that, this also helps out the recoil gun kick and vertical and horizontal recoil control, but you don't lose any ADS. So if you want to ADS faster, use the rear grip. But if you want the most recoil control, I would throw on the combo stock. But if you want to use the optic, I would just take off the under barrel and throw on whatever optic you like. I like to use a Jack Glasses optic, but use whatever you're comfortable with. But check out this build and let me know what you think in the comments.